what's up y'all and welcome back to my channel it is summer not officially but it might as well be because it is hot as you know what outside school is out sun is bright the pools are open and i'm here for it but i thought it would be fun to go through my collection scrounge through all my eyeshadow palettes and pull out the ones that just remind me of summer now I'm not necessarily the type of person who does my makeup according to the seasons, but sometimes I absolutely love to be inspired by it. So if you are that person, you're looking for a little inspiration, maybe you have some of these palettes in your collection that you forgot about, pull them out. Now is the time to use them. So if you want to see which 21 palettes I have pulled from my collection that I think are absolutely perfect for summer, then keep on watching. All right, y'all, so this is in no particular order. This is not a ranking. This is just giving you some inspiration, some ideas. I will link and list as many of these eyeshadow palettes as I can down in the comment section, and I will also put everything that I am wearing on my face. I have already filmed this look. Both of the videos have already gone up with it, but in case you missed them, it will be down in that comment section. Some of these palettes may be discontinued, maybe out of stock. I apologize if you can't get them anymore, but you know, I'm absolutely 100% sure a lot of you still have them in your collection, so this is your reminder to pull them out now let's go ahead and jump into this so the first one that i have is from blend bunny this is the surge palette oh this one is so beautiful and she was recently discontinued but tell me that is not summer vibes we have an entire row of neons down here they're beautiful they're gorgeous they're pigmented they look beautiful on the eyes if you have this in your collection pull it out show it some love because this is one of my favorites from the brand i'm so sad that it's discontinued but i understand why she did it Things can't stick around forever, but this is one of my absolute favorites for even fall, spring, all of it. But summer, it has that vibe. I have another one from Blend Bunny, and that is the Lore Palette. This one is so beautiful as well. This one is giving like mermaid vibes. And when I think of mermaids, I think of the summer. So this one is perfect for that. I love the colors in here. This is probably my absolute favorite one from Blend Bunny. We have that beautiful formula. We have all these shimmers up here. We have this multi-chrome that is absolutely stunning. You've got your neutrals, but these definitely pull a little on the cooler side. There's just so much you can do with this, so much variety. I love this row of mid-tones right here. They are bright, they're tropical, they're fun, and this one, as the rest of these, I'm going to sound like a broken record, is perfect for summer. From Ace Beauté, I have the Palettopoly palette. This one gives me Barbie vibes, and of course, when I think of Barbie, I think of summer because Malibu, pool parties, the Barbie movie came out in the summer, but this palette is so beautiful. You've got pinks, you've got purples. Again, the theme across the board is going to be bright, vibrant colors. It's going to be neons, things like that, and this one's beautiful. I love this palette. I believe this one's still available. If it is, it will absolutely be linked down below, but I'm excited to pull this one back out and play with it. From Cosmic Beauty, formerly Cosmic Brushes, we have the Delicious Delights palette. This one actually came out the end of last summer. This is supposed to be more of their pastel palette, but we definitely have some of those bright neons in here. This shade right here on the inner corner is absolutely beautiful. If you have not tried the Cosmic Beauty formula, you need to. They are a UK indie brand. It is affordable. I don't know how they get the price point so low on these. They have a new one that they just sneak peeked that is coming out very soon. I'm excited about, but we've got mattes. We've got multi-chromes, duo-chromes. We have this absolutely beautiful like ethereal shade over here. I love this palette and this one just it gives me all the summer goodness. From Lethal Cosmetics we have the Wildflower palette. This one is absolutely beautiful. This hot pink shade right here is so so pretty. This green on the lid I'm going to try not to do a whole lot of swatches but I want to show you like how gorgeous is that shade it has like the most beautiful like sheen flip to it it is absolutely gorgeous it's like a green to a blue very like almost topper ethereal it's just gorgeous on the lid and i love it it's one of my favorite shades in my entire collection but this is a beautiful palette the formula is fantastic you've got all kinds of different shimmers in here multi-chromes duo chromes the matte formula is fantastic and if you take out this hot pink it's definitely more on the subdued side still bright still fun for summer but maybe not quite as intimidating 
Of course, we have to talk about the Nomad Cosmetics Monte Verde Cloud Forest Palette. This one is stunning. This is a bright neon rainbow palette. It is very heavy on the green side, which is the whole idea behind it, but this one's perfect for summer. It definitely has tropical vibes. If you want some neons, if you want some neutrals, this is going to be your girl. Now, the shimmers in here are not the absolute best. This is a little bit of their older shimmer formula, but they're still beautiful. They still look good on the eyes, but the mattes in this palette are where it's at, and they're absolutely stunning. All right, if you want something a little more neutral, but still kind of has that summer theme and vibe, I gotcha. Well, Bella Beauty Bar does actually. That is the Sun and Sea palette that they came out with last summer. This one has some color in it, but is definitely heavy on the neutral side. There is a lot of color overlap in here. I realized that, but it still gives summer vibes. You can do a total neutral look and pop on one of these shades, pop on a little bit of color. We've got the blues, we've got the purples. We have this mermaid on the front, which like I said earlier, screen summer and the formula in here is beautiful the shimmers in here are beautiful this is the good the new Bella Beauty Bar formula that we know and love from them lately and I really do enjoy this palette it's not one of my favorites from the brand because it does have a lot of like brown overlap up here I don't know what was going on but it still screams summer it's still one that I like to play with in the summer and I'm excited about the Adept Cosmetics Seahorse Palette. This is a 15 pan palette full of nothing but shimmers. Perfect for those one and done looks in the summer. You can even throw a bronzer in the crease, one or two of these on the lid, be out the door. They are beautiful, they are shifty. We've got holochromes, multichromes, duochromes, everything in this palette. And this palette's getting discontinued, but she is coming back next summer with a makeover. I don't know what they're gonna do with it. I'm excited to see, but it is on sale. All the details are over on Adept. So if you've been, I in this palette you've been wanting it and you haven't picked it up yet now's your chance I do really recommend it. it is definitely worth the price tag it is that beautiful adept formula that we all know and love and I'm so happy to have my hands on this but I cannot wait to see what it looks like when it comes back the Unearthly Cosmetics Get Groovy palette. This was part of their large summer mystery box from last year, 2023. And this is essentially a rainbow palette. It's not a complete rainbow. We don't have a red in here. We do have this deep maroon. I didn't pull in all of my rainbow palettes because we could go for a while if I did. I feel like those kind of go without saying, but this one is beautiful. If it's still available, which I believe it is, it is on a deep, deep discount on the Unearthly website. So if you want this, now is your chance to get your hands on it, but this is beautiful. I'm so happy to have this. The shimmers in here are so beautiful. Unearthly has really stepped up their shimmer formula within the last year, and this palette is absolutely stunning. Let's talk about these two palettes from Odin's Eye. These were collab palettes that came out the beginning of 2023. And at first we have this one from Lauren May Beauty. This is the Sea Talk palette. This is a little bit more on the neutral side, but it's perfect for that neutral lover that wants a pop of color. Blue and brown paired together is absolutely beautiful. It has a little bit of color, but it's not so much that it's overwhelming if you're not a color lover. This shade right here is absolutely beautiful on the inner corner. I love to do it with a monochromatic blue or a monochromatic brown like I said combine the two together and this shade all over the lid is beautiful as well we also have the planet spirit palette in collaboration with Betty Jean that came out with this same collection it's summer right summer in a palette bright vibrant I love pairing these three shades together they're absolutely beautiful you can do a monochromatic purple even a monochromatic green with a little bit of a pop of pink or maybe even like this shade on the inner corner is absolutely beautiful if you have these palettes in your collection pull them out and show them some love this summer the Fantasy Cosmetics Sorcerer Palette. This one is stunning. It's absolutely beautiful. It's pink, it's green, it's blue, but again, it's bright, it's vibrant. I love the shades in this palette. The matte formula is really, really nice, but the shimmers in this palette are absolutely beautiful. You could do one matte, throw on a shimmer. You can do an all shimmer look. There's lots of possibilities in here. It is on the smaller side. So again, if you just want to add a little bit of color to your collection, maybe you don't want something so big, so over overwhelming this is a beautiful palette I highly recommend it I love fantasy cosmetica and I love that we have something bright and fun from the brand 
Let's go ahead and talk about the palette that is actually on my eyes, and that is the Tropical Palette from Beauty Bay. This is the first time I've ever tried the brand. This is the first time that I've ever tried this palette, so I can't give you a full review on it, but the color story in here is beautiful. I love the way that the shades that I use performed. I do have a look up on my channel um, as a short using this video, so go ahead and check that out if you want to see what shades I use, but this is a beautiful palette. I love the vibe. It's very summer. It's giving me strawberry lemonade vibe, and I'm here for it. So if you're wanting to dabble into color without breaking the bank, head over to Beauty Bay because this palette is super affordable. It was actually on um, big time discount whenever I picked it up and I'm loving it so far. I'm happy to have it and I cannot wait to continue to play with it. We have the Nueva Vida palette from Gourmand Girls and Steps Beauty Stash. This one came out earlier this year and I told y'all in my dedicated video that this was going to be perfect for summer and it absolutely is. These two shades right here are so incredibly bright, vibrant neon. They're beautiful on the eye. They go on beautiful. They don't have too much of a white base that they just kind of disappear. They build up beautifully. They last. The formula in here is absolutely gorgeous. You can definitely get some neutral shades, add in that pop of color, but I love this palette. I love what the brand and Steph did with this. It's beautiful and summer's here and I'm ready to pull it back out. We have another Strawberry Lemonade Vibes palette. This one is the Sweet Dreams palette. Comes to us from CXC Beauty and this one is gorgeous. It is a little big, it is a little repetitive, but they do have like a nine pan version of this palette. So if you like the color story, you just don't want something as big, you can definitely get it in a smaller version. But the formula in here is absolutely beautiful. The shimmers are beautiful. I really enjoyed playing with this. And this is another one that I knew from the minute I picked it up, it was gonna be perfect for summer. It's not quite as vibrant as the one from Beauty Bay. So if that's too much for you, you can scale it back and go with this one, but I love it. I'm I'm really enjoying the brand so far and this palette is gorgeous. From Clarity Cosmetics, we have the Euphoria palette. This one is a little bit on the deeper side, but for me, it still kind of screams summer if I want something a little darker. I don't want to go quite as bright and vibrant. This one gives me like mermaid vibes. I know it's not a mermaid theme, which they're actually coming out with three new palettes that are more mermaid themed. So keep your eyes out for those. But this palette is absolutely beautiful. This shade right here, which is called Vibing, is so, so stunning. Let me show you a swatch on my hand because it just is so flippy, so shiny, so reflective. It reminds me of the scales on a mermaid's tail and I love it as a one and done shade and I think it's gonna be absolutely beautiful in the summer. So if you have this palette, pull it out, do this all over your lid just by itself. I promise you will not be disappointed. From Ladybug Glow, we have the Creatura palette. This one came out either like end of last year, beginning of this year. I can't remember which one. Unfortunately, it's no longer available. Ladybug Glow is on a small hiatus. They may or may not come back in the future. She's unsure, but this palette is gorgeous. I love the bright, vibrant colors in here. We do have some deeper, more subdued ones, a little bit of grunginess going on. This is a good one to transition you from summer to fall, and I love the shimmers in here. They are absolutely beautiful. We've got a multi-chrome over here. We've got duo chromes. These are beautiful. I love this palette. If you have this in your collection, you were lucky enough to get it, pull it out and play with it. So I missed an Adept palette when I went over the Seahorse one, but we have the Cyborg Choir palette. This one came out earlier this spring, and while it definitely has a spring vibe to it, it also has a summer vibe to it. It's the shimmers in here. These two right here are absolutely beautiful. They're very unique in my collection. I don't have other shimmers like them in my collection, and I love them. The mattes in this palette are really good from Adept. Their mattes are kind of hit or miss, but the ones in here are beautiful. I love the color combination. I love that we've got multiple multi-chromes, duochromes, holochromes. We have different textures. We've got different formulas in here. There's a lot of variation and this one is absolutely beautiful. Definitely one of my favorites, if not my absolute favorite from the brand. All right, we have three left. Let's go ahead and finish this off. From Dee Dee's Signature, we have the Ultimate Cappuccino Palette. And again, you've got some summer shades in here, but again, more on the neutral side. So if you love your neutrals, but you want just a good pop of color, maybe you wanna dig into indie brands, but you're not into bright color, 
this is a beautiful formula this is a beautiful palette you can definitely go neutral you can add in those pops the shimmers in here are beautiful they're not anything crazy they're not anything like over the top but they are absolutely beautiful this one over here which is called pumpkin spice looks so pretty on the lid again we've got different textures different formulas the matte formula in this palette is absolutely beautiful i'm so excited to have this one i didn't pick it up when it launched because i didn't think it was going to be anything that i loved but then i got it in my ice cream beauty box and i tried it and it's beautiful and i love this palette so so much from Ensley Rain, we have the Cosmic Dreamer palette. This is another one that I'm not quite done reviewing yet. I've only used it a couple of times, but this is another one of those palettes that you can absolutely get some bright, fun, colorful looks out of it. It can take you into fall. You've got your blues down here, which I love blue eyeshadow in the summer. The shimmers in here are absolutely stunning. I love this palette. This one... I think is absolutely my favorite from the brand. I really, really enjoy this palette. I love the color combinations in here. I love the vibrancy of the mattes. I love the formula of the mattes. The shimmers, like I said, are absolutely beautiful. The theming is beautiful. This is a good palette, and this one is actually going to be a really good year-round palette. And last but not least, we have the ColourPop Pokemon palette. I haven't quite played with every single shade in this palette yet, so I don't have my full collective thoughts, but so far I'm really enjoying it. I love that we have a bright, vibrant, colorful palette. We do have a couple of neutrals here, so you can definitely take more neutral route if you want to, but this shade right here, Gem Leader, paired with this one, which is called Fuchsia City, is absolutely a beautiful color combination. I did a look with just those two, and I love the way that it turned out, but but I'm enjoying it. I really like this palette. I think it's perfect for summer. And the best part is this comes in at an affordable price point compared to some of these other palettes. All right, y'all. So there you have it. 21 palettes that I pulled from my collection that I think are absolutely perfect for summer. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. I hope this gave you a little bit of inspiration to dig into your collection and show some love to some of those palettes that were at one time new and exciting and have just been kind of collecting dust. As much as I love a new eyeshadow palette, I love playing with these too because at one point, like I said, they were new and exciting. But let me know if you want to see any looks with any of these palettes. I can absolutely throw some shorts together maybe I can even do like a multiple palette multiple look video also I want to know what is your favorite palette to use in the summer let's have that conversation light up that comment section and as usual I want to thank you all so much for watching my video and spending your time with me it truly does mean so so much to me and if you like this video make sure you give it a big thumbs up before you leave don't forget to hit that subscribe button and click on that notification bell so that you can be notified of all my future posts here on my channel I do post quite a few videos every single week and I wouldn't want you to miss one, but until my next video, have a good one. Bye.